Check it out. Look. Here we go. Monty, we gonna, we gonna, yeah, we're gonna fight about this one. Go ahead. Why why are we gonna fight it? Fight about it. Look at it. Go, go, yeah, I, yeah. Look at it. I, I, I love this album. I, I love the Outcast album covers. I I go ahead. I'm I I want to hear what you got to because look, listen, you're the you are the, the 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 visual artist, right? Yeah. You are the painter, you are the sculptor, you are the the artist. I have seen this man do shit with crayons and markers that should not be possible. Okay, so I want to. I, I respect your eye. So first, tell us about the great album, and then tell us about why you think this album is shitty. Yeah, uh, Aquemini is one of my favorite Outcast album, uh, albums. I love this album from top to bottom. Both parts of the art of storytelling are probably in my top twenty favorite songs of all time. Don't know where they fall in there. Both of them. Um, just love, love, love this album. I, I hate looking at this album cover. I, I hate it. Like, like it, for, first, first, like, and I, I, I hate shitting on artists as much, but seriously, why is Andre a fucking midget? Look at him. Look at his proportions, honestly. That that ain't right. <laughs> that ain't right. You're supposed to call them little people, Monty. You're not supposed to call them Whatever, no whatever. Way. But, Look at why is why who squished Andre, and 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 big boy sitting there don't like the look of him. I don't like how hard it is to see the Aquarius and Gemini symbols. I had mm-hmm. to look for that shit to figure it out. Like there's too much that I had to stop and study to see in this. I I just I don't like the composition of this. I I hate it. I hate every bit of it. I, I can't even program myself to say anything negative about Outkast. So, mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I can't do it. Listen, I love this album cover, and I'm gonna tell you why. Because this album cover is an homage to two things: black exploitation albums like your, your Curtis Mayfield albums yeah. and your Johnny Guitar Watson albums, and your Parliament album. Right. This is Outkast doing their version of a Parliament Funkadelic album cover. Right. Yeah, and, they, and that they, was they, happening at that time. Yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. They, they, uh, yeah. uh-huh. And and I I, I I like that it's drawn. I, I like I like this artist's interpretation of this project. Like, look, I might be a little biased because I like in my mind, like Outkast is the greatest rap at rap group of all time. End of sentence, full yeah. stop, argue with your mama. I'm yeah, and you I'm, I'm this is me saying this as a huge Wu Tang clan fan. I used to love Bone Thugs and Harmony. The Migos is the shit. Them niggas that them you people ain't got nothing on on Outkast. Andre Benjamin, big boy, like God tier rappers, right? Yeah. Like they were a, a large part of the reason that I wanted to move to Atlanta. Was yeah. because I was like, man, like out they got Outkast, Goody Mob, Ludacris, and Ti, fucking Young Jeezy, Gucci man. I was ready to come to Atlanta and be like, yo, man, these dudes, because it was a different sound, like, and what they were doing sonically was something I'd never heard before. Now each project, whether you know Southern Playlistic, uh, if it was a uh, uh, AT Aliens, they were doing something different. And with a criminal. I just felt all oh, these dudes was in their bag. This was this yeah. was the last album I think they did with um, with uh, organized, uh, organized noise. noise doing the production. Uh, yeah. And organized noise, uh, you know, did all of Outkast production. They did all of uh, CeeLo Green and, and Goody Miles production. But you know, they also had like other really big hits they did for people. Very and one of those big joints was Waterfalls for TLC. You know what I'm saying? Don't go chasing waterfalls. That yeah. was organized noise did that. Okay? These like this was a production team of like stars amongst stars. And when I saw this album cover, it was like I love how delightfully black it was and I love this homage that it was to to that specific style of funk record at the time. So yeah, Monty, I respectfully disagree with you. <laughs> yeah, but but let no, me. you know what? No, no, no. I don't respectfully disagree with you. I disrespectfully disagree uh, disagree with you. Okay. All right. I'm, I'm a your, challenge your whole ass opinion. you people. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I don't like. I, yeah. You know what? I disagree. Fight me on it. Okay. Oh, I, I will. Love this I will. Part. 
This I album will. cover is great. I will right now because mm-hmm. your entire defense of that album cover rested solely, not solely, not solely, mostly on how great Outkast was and their impact. Which I, 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 I respect. I said, what, and what, then the words, that, no, the words that I said was this: I love this cover because it was an homage to these two styles of covers. Right? Yeah, that's they all you at, said about they, they, it. They, and that, that, that is, that is what, what more? What else you need me to say? That's well, what I. That's well, what no, I you went say. on this you, whole thing you, that ended with that. So, like, let's just stick to the meat, which is. It's no, no, no mind. I get it. Phrase that different. Say that different. Say that <laughs> different way. No, uh-uh, no. Listen, let's I will just, back out of this argument right now. Let's just stick to the argument. Right as long as you just say that different, okay? Jesus okay, Christ. Okay, let's stick to that argument. <laughs> okay, um, there we go. Let's stick to that argument, right? Um, um, We're not look, sticking look, nothing when, to the meat, okay? Yeah, when that like, gets clipped out, Arby's. put Monty's the solid snake exclamation point noise when I say the meat. <laughs> and clip the part out where I gave that direction. <laughs> I'm gonna say it to Andre. I'm gonna uh-huh. say it to Andre. Cause no, look at this figure. Look at this figure. It's stylized. Mm-hmm. It's got its mm-hmm. own. It's got a unique look and feel. This mm-hmm. feels like I get what they were that trying thing looks to like do. Sammy Davis Jr. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it does. It does. <laughs> it it look it looks like those dolls on uh, Tales from the Hood. They, the the yes. diglets that came yes. out was trying to kill people. Yes. It look like yeah. But no, what I'm saying is, I get all that. I get what they mm-hmm. were trying to do, but I don't think it looks as good as it could. It, I don't think it looks good. I think mm-hmm. the artist was wrong for this because I believe the same artist did AT Aliens, and I like the art on that. I don't like his art on this. I think his art fails and feels bad on this. There are other artists that could have been hired probably for the same rate or cheaper or maybe a tiny bit more expensive that could have pulled this off better. This does not work. Like, it, he, I, it, it, it doesn't work. Could have been done better. Hey, listen, Cry Baby, look, you know what? Cry Baby 4321, Lil Foxy Brown, Pam Greer. I get the throwback. See? That's what I'm saying. Like, like this picture was an homage to a certain style of black art. Yeah. And yeah, and, yeah and, and I and I think they did a great job of nailing it. Right? If, if, if the job was to make it seem like one of those things, then I think they did exactly what they were supposed to do. Yeah, I think it just looks bad. It looks bad. First, this not thriller, boy. You yeah, just the proportions are off on Ooh. both of them, on both Big Boy and Andre. Monty got some hate in his heart today, y'all. Boy. <laughs> oh, man, he he got he got some evil in the spirit today, y'all. Oh my god, we gonna pray for Monty, y'all. We all finna pray for him, okay? Then pray. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and look, listen. I love this album. This album is fantastic. Token Black Man said uh, uh, the art of storytelling does not get the credit. The uh, storytelling part two does not get the credit it deserves. Yes. Yeah, the art of storytelling is just a fantastic series. Yeah, uh, both of, tracks. Fantastic series of records. Both both songs are great. You know, the art of storytelling part two is fantastic. Uh, Skew it on the Barbie, Rosa yes. Parks. Um, yep. Yeah, this album is fantastic. What yeah, is top to bottom. What, great fucking album. Yeah, let's see. What did the? I'm, I'm looking at the the album sales. I want to see how it did. Um, I know it was very critically acclaimed. It is it is largely uh, uh, certifications. Here we go. Jeez, uh, y'all sold some units. Uh, they sold three million in the, in the states. Uh, yeah, they sold three at, at three million. So it's triple platinum. Yeah, and why the obvious digital flares on it? That the the shit might have been fine without the flares. <laughs> maybe, maybe I don't know. I don't know how to remove them. I, listen, I, 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 don't, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm not. I like. I, I ain't finna. I ain't finna argue with you, man. Like I said, you the listen. You the artist. I see what it's supposed to be. You don't see what it's supposed to be. I, I see what it's supposed to be. I don't think it works. I don't think it happened. Yeah, I think. It, well, listen, it bought, got bought three million times. It was okay. It, it, That's because it it's a good fucking album. Mm-hmm. You saying if they had different artwork, it could have sold better. No, I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that our words bad. Y'all, y'all, y'all finished or y'all done? I ain't got no more talking. Sweet Halloween and collard greens.